A very good evening and welcome to the Martin Sporting Complex here in Adelaide in the W League and what a terrific game we have in store for us tonight. It is uh, round 10 here of the W League. Top side Sydney FC visit the City of Churches up against Adelaide United who, uh, well if they win tonight, will be the most games they've ever won in a season in the existence of the W League. And what a big scalp this would be. Here comes the corner. Not a bad corner there from Og. There's the header and there's the goal and that is, whoa, whoa, would you guess it and would you believe it? Tracy Holmes has scored. Dylan Holmes even. Dylan, what a, I beg your pardon, Dylan Holmes. What a wonderful <laughs> header and a wonderful ball. Wow. I'd only just written down in my notes today that <laughs> Adelaide United really struggling from set pieces this season, really struggling to find their, the back of the net. Might even be the first corner they've scored, I think, this season. It was a lovely ball driven into the back post. <laughs> And it was Mariska Walders. Oh, we got it wrong, didn't we? It was actually Mariska Walders who scored that goal. Well, she's a dangerous player. She's so good on the ball. She's had a free kick. They're allowed to play on. But here they come again. Adelaide United. Weber gets around now on the left peg. Has a snap at shot at the goal, rather. It didn't miss by much. It was always going away. We had a terrific angle here from our broadcast position, uh, uh, Robbie. But a good effort there by uh, Mallory Weber. Weber again. She's got a few tricks in her locker. If she can get around one, she does. Now she'll try with a crack. What a strike. What a goal. Just talking about uh, Mallory Weber not scoring enough goals. Well, that'll have to be pretty close to the goal of the season. 2-0 Adelaide. Well, what a start from Adelaide United. We knew they were a team capable of causing an upset. Now a lot of space on the right-hand side for Chelsea Dorber, the number 10 for Adelaide. Well, the Reds coming forward now. Here comes the cross. Plays it in early. Over the top, Holmes on the chest, looking to have a strike. She goes down. That might be a free kick against uh, Holmes, and uh, both players have hit the deck, and they both stay on the ground. Well, Holmes uh, does get up, but uh, she just it's Tobin down. It's hard to see from here. Yeah, looks like uh, she needs assistance pretty well straight away. Certainly hasn't been her night, but really, to be fair, hasn't been a lot of the players' line a night. Here comes Adelaide again, an opportunity, and we'll take yeah, down here. Chance here for Rojas, but. Uh, that's the first real save that uh, Wyman had to make, really, and she really held it pretty well, too. Theresa Polis now to get the ball in, floats it in over the top, dangerous for Adelaide. Oh, we've got uh, the head of, uh, I reckon, a Sydney player, and again, there's a clash of heads and uh, a few bodies on the ground there, Robbie. Doesn't look good. Yeah, really brave from all players wow. there, putting their bodies on the line. Rojas just skipped away Dorber's from Polis. in here. Fantastic ball there to Dorber. Chelsea Dorber, the keeper coming out off her line. Dorber has got an open goal. She's going to try, in fact, she passes to Rojas. Rojas for Adelaide to put it away and just misses the far post. Well, that was beautifully played by Adelaide and all it needed was that ball to hit the back of the net for Maria Rojas. Hog again with another corner, swings it away from goal. Home fans cheering, the ball comes in, hits the crossbar there. I reckon it was from uh, the goal scorer from the first half and the ball's gone back over the bar. I reckon that was Marushka Waldus who hit the post, or the crossbar rather. So another great chance for Adelaide United. Marie Weber for Adelaide. Now she's got a few tricks as we know. Step over, gets around one way and the other. Here comes the ball across the face of goal. And oh, the topo there from uh, Chelsea Dorber. Just missed the, the uh, far post. I think it was Condon, actually. I think Dorber was waiting patiently behind her. And what a run from Mallory Weber. 